We are a creation of our own environment. Human beings are emotional creatures. And it's their perception of the world that creates who they are. So what you think causes what you feel inside. Your brain releases chemicals into your body to make you feel exactly how you think. And when you start feeling how you think, it causes more thoughts to be created, which causes more chemicals to flow. And this just keeps going on and on. Now, if it's a good thing, if it's happy, then those thoughts and those feelings are fantastic. Okay, it's euphoric. But if you're sad, the same rules apply. Human beings make emotional decisions, and then they support it with reason and rationality after the fact. Emotion always comes first. Somebody asked me, I was doing a live event yesterday, and somebody said to me, they said, can you train yourself to put your, your rational mind first? And I said, you can train yourself to do anything. You can train yourself to bark like a dog, but you're not wired that way. We're wired to allow our emotions to be the contributing factor to who and what we are. We're emotional creatures and we connect with people on an emotional scale. So yeah, emotions always come first. It's not just about work. It's no. not, it's about everything. It's like a guy who lies. Guy who lies turns around, first time he feels bad. Second time, it feels bad. Third time, I still feel bad, but I can go on. The fourth time, it's like, no problem. And your procrastination works the same way. The first time, they think, oh, geez, you know what? I should have really done this. The second time, gets a little easier. Third time, gets a little easier. Because you're developing a habit. And habits are supposed to make life easy. And so what you do is you continually build on that. Okay? Until eventually, it just becomes so easy to procrastinate.